Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Fortnite Save the World, and welcome to the weekly reset, guys. The weekly loot reset, the weekly shop reset, the weekly store reset, whatever you want to call it that, guys. That is what's going to happen right now, and this one brings us something a little bit extra. It brings us the hot mix pistol. So we're going to try this hot mix pistol out because right now I'm pretty sure there's not going to be much anything else that we're going to need to go over. But regardless, let's take a look. I am on my 622nd day, day. Let's go. Well, let's go straight to the item shop. Uh, I've got myself two free llamas. I want it to be a surprise. Okay. That's I've so cool. Look at look hide. at this purple thing right here. All right. So we got two free llamas. Um, Let's go ahead and get them right now. Uh, I did miss my free llamas a couple of days ago. Oh yeah. I I don't you know. I mean, goods. I guess have we been getting multiple free llamas? Ooh. Hello, legend, uh, epic, mythic. Hey, I do I need her? How bad do I need her? Is she one of the ones that I need? No. Um, I need him, her, and that's it now. Wow. Okay. Still free. <laughs> Why not? What Mythic free. Ooh. What's Hello. Fifteen hundred smorgasbord. No. Am I gonna get super no, nice? guys. Look. It's a Mercury LMG, which doesn't have. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Dude. Okay. okay. All right. Let's get this one here you know. before I forget. Get myself this legendary one. Um, I don't know if you guys got him too. If you guys got him too, make sure to go over and get these two free llamas. And that smorgasbord again for one thousand. There she is. That's awesome. For one thousand five hundred V bucks, guys. It's just not worth it, guys. Just I'm sorry, but it's it's really just not worth it. Um, if you want the tickets, I guess. If you're gonna do it, please use my creator code. I would really appreciate it. Uh, but personally for me, I I, I just don't feel it's you know. I just don't feel it's uh it, it's 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 worth it, but that's just me. Anyway, let's keep going, guys. Uh, let's go here. All right, so let's go over to the shop. There it is, the copper hot mix. Let's make sure there's nothing else new over here. Nothing over here. Zapatron, worst weapon in the game. I, I really don't like it. It it packs a punch, but that's it. It's a it's a one. It's a one shot, you know, that's it. Um, we've got Reaper, we've got Pure Drops of Rain, we got all the evolution stuff, all that good stuff. You know what I say, guys? If you're gonna get all this stuff, make sure to start with the armor slot. That's the first one I recommend. Then the Reaper, then if you needed the uncommon and rare, which I'm starting to need it again. And of course, all of the evolutionary materials because there's no other way to get them and we don't have the twine tweaks changes yet. But let's go into this guys the hot mix pistol boombox fires a pair of sonic blast to pierce enemies boosts a large clip size with low recoil this hot mix will get your feet moving what is that large magazine size 30 is not bad 30 is enough to build up a little bit so it's nothing like the plasmatron you know you guys know that but it, it's it's got a little bit uh 2300 head damage is not bad to begin with range is 2000 which is not bad at all is that 2,000 inches? Because I kind of feel like those are the distance they use here. <laughs> uh, reload time 1.4. 1.4 reload time to begin with? That is amazing. That is amazing. And impact is pretty decent as well. All right, let's go ahead and get it. And find out what is so important about this copper hot mix. Is it worth it, guys? Is it worth leveling it up? You guys know we do this every single time we have a new weapon. It's our first look at it. We're going to go through it. We're going to look at it. We're going to see just what is good about it. So, as we level it up, let's read about it. <clears throat> I got hitting an enemy with this weapon has a small chance to cause it and nearby enemies to dance and take fire affliction for a short duration. All of the we of the enemies even dancing? Oh my goodness, that is crazy. Does not affect enemies have recently been dancing. Dance does not affect miss monsters or bosses. The dance does it doesn't but will the okay the dance will affect them but will the fire affliction okay first off please let me know guys did you guys get this too did everyone everyone watching did you also get the fire affliction because i'm very curious about this fire affliction. all right what we're gonna do you guys know what we're gonna do we're gonna take this all the way up to level 130 
Are we going to make it Obsidian or Shadow Shard, though? Let's take a quick look here at what's going to... Oh, my gosh. Look at that damage. What? Okay. So, damage goes to almost 12,000. Impact, 1,000. Shadow Shard... 14,347 in impact almost 1100. Oh my goodness gracious guys Fire rate it goes down it, it yeah, it's got to be shadow shard It's got to be you know what the worst part about this guys is that making a shadow shard means I'm gonna have to use quartz crystals and I have a feeling we're gonna use this but look at that damage look at that crit Oh my god, okay. All right. We got to make a shadow shard guys. Uh, you guys know what I've said about this event weapons now I kind of do feel because of the look at the reload on this thing because of the fire rate and the reload I um, I'm really tempted really tempted to make this obsidian very tempted to make it obsidian. Um, I Really am. Oh my goodness. I am I am so tempted to make this obsidian Take away that reload speed and just make it. Oh my goodness. We can make it full critical. We can make it critic We can make it critical I'm really tempted guys at this fire rate and this reload this weapon would be a monster if we can oh my goodness we're gonna burn through this like crazy but you guys know what I say always make him uh, always make him shadow shard make him shadow shard if they are event weapons when in doubt make him shadow shard also this is going to I'm surprised these aren't basically um, what's it called I'm surprised they're not energy right off the bat you know Anyway, um, let's go ahead and keep going. This guess, this has quite a bit more. That's almost triple the range of the woofer. And they're pier it's piercing too. My goodness, what 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 is this thing? All right, let's take a look at the perks. Um, I'm gonna go ahead right now, and we're just gonna go ahead and take this up to rare. We're just gonna take them to rare. You guys know what we do. We're gonna take them to rare. This reload speed, we don't even need that. Oh my goodness, you can do cri triple critical rating. Oh my, you can do double critical, double critical damage. Okay, all right, we're gonna, we're, we're not gonna mess with it yet, okay? Um, I'm gonna tell you this, that I'm probably gonna take away those reload speed, guys. And I'm gonna turn it into a critical rating, and then turn this critical rating into a critical damage, all right? That, that just feels like what we're gonna have to do, because... It's going to be a double. It's going to be a double double. It's, it's, it has to be. It has to be one. But right now, we're going to keep it like this. I want to see what this reload does. And I also believe that this weapon is going to be good enough to take up to, to legendary perks. But let's go over and we're going to jump into a level 140 mission. Uh, why not? Let's go into this ghost town. So let's go. Ooh, look at that ghost town with double 150 reperk and quad legendary. The fight category four storm do fight category four storm uh not something that i would be looking forward to doing um let's go ahead oh i don't have a pistol setup right now i don't have a pistol setup right now i lost my pistol setup um let's see do we have anyone that has a bit of a pistol setup no we don't right now um do we want to make one really quick we can't, you know what? We're not going to. Right now, you know what? I'm just going to go in with Tactical. I know he's going to have mad tidings to start up. That's going to help him a little bit. It doesn't have any other... It doesn't have any pistol uh, bonuses or anything. But we're going to do this right now because I kind of have a little bit of, bit of a feeling <clears throat> that this weapon is going to warrant a second look at. And when we do that second look, then we'll take it up to Legendary and we'll take it in with a proper pistol setup. Uh, because a proper pistol setup will oh my goodness it, it's gonna it's gonna increase its damage Should we put it up up side by side? This is the plan. Is it the plasma tron 9000? I keep forgetting if it's the plasma tron 9000 or not Hmm anyway, let's see. Okay, so Yeah, we're just gonna have to do a part two guys. We're gonna have to do a part two with a proper pistol setup and See if it's going to be worth it. Also um let me check over here. Yes. So for those of you wondering, there is a V-Bucks mission today. It is in Stonewood. It's a level five, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Um, okay. I'm going to have to go check that out. But right now, let's go ahead and... Why am I full? Oh. 
I really wish that I had also had prepared a pistol setup, but you know, we didn't have that right now. Um, let's go ahead and wait, why am I full again? What? Well, that's a creepy sound. Um, here we go. There. Oh, and I do have a Plasmatron 9000 to kind of compare it side by side with. Uh, my Plasmatron 9000 is legendary though. Oof, okay. Um, all right, let's take a quick look at it. Oh, here we go. Good first test. Actually, in action test. Oh, it's a slow shooting. It's a slow shooter. And fire affliction. I mean. Okay, well, let me say this right now. Check this reload right now. Chook, chook, chook. Wow, okay. You got saved. I. You know what? Wow. That is so weird. This is such a weird aim. All right, let's see. Uh, 2000 is going to be located. like here. Oh, we can see what it's going to do against the Smasher, too. Let's take out these guys first. All right, I'm going to take these guys out first like this. Ow. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I know how to use this weapon first, so that's why I'm using it. Goodness gracious, stop! Stop! Can't go through the thing, can Alright. Ouch! Goodness gracious! Are you like never gonna die, man? This target's a tricky one. It is a tricky one. Come on! Come on! <sighs> Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Come on. There you go. Okay, you're dead. Reload it. Reload it. Get out of my way. All right, let's see what we can do. Oh, perfect. He got stuck under. Perfect. No, he didn't get stuck under. But he is there. Okay. So 60s, 30s, 70s, 70s, 80s, 82, 83. And I'm guessing that's going to be about as high as we're going to get with the stacks, right? Because we're trying to build... Oh, it's it's so slow. 92. 93. Okay, so it looks like I maxed out. I took a little over half of his bar with one full clip. I mean, that's not bad. Oh, does give fire affliction. It did fire... Aff okay. All right. It did fire afflict... The enemy, the the smasher. That's really awesome. Oh my goodness, that's really awesome. Yeah, this is not gonna do. What? Oh, I was like, who? What did? That, what did that to me? Okay, so it's making them all dance around, causing them fire affliction as well. They all disappeared because I got too far away. You know what? It's got potential. It's got potential. I'm not going to deny that. Um, it definitely has potential. It's an interesting little weapon. 
Yeah, it, it, it doesn't pack a punch yet, though. Right now, it doesn't pack a punch. I mean, we're going up against level 174 enemies. You guys saw what it can do there. It it has potential. I am going to say this right now, though. I I do... Maxing out at 93,000, you know, from 60 to 93,000. Of course, you guys saw the build I was using. So I did have that crack shot and startup, you know, kind of bonus there. Um, I mean, that's okay. And it's each shot. So it has potential. It has huge potential. All right. I'm going to leave it there, guys. That's the first look for this weapon. I am very, very, very excited for it. I think, yes, it does, it, it's, we're going to take away that reload because we're not going to need it. It's way too fast. We're going to make a double crit. We're going to make a double crit rating. Um, do I want to keep it physical? No, I don't actually. I don't. I'm actually kind of thinking of turning it into an, a water weapon. Water that causing ice affliction. Water and ice? Yes. Hot mix is going to be the water and ice weapon. I was going to say the water and ice, uh, pocket monster thing. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. As always, I am DUJ2. Let's go hunting really quickly for that. Stonewood level 5. I think it was... What was it? Um, there it is. Retrieval data. So there's a level, 20, uh, level 5. 25 V-Buck Retrieval data. Go check it out if you need to. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. As always, I am DUJ2. If you guys enjoy this video, if you enjoy what I do on my channel, please do me a huge favor. And have yourself a wonderful day. The hot mix. It's got potential, guys. It's got potential. I want to check it out with a really decent setup. It might be my main weapon with my zap. Oh, I just had an idea. I love how they did the speakers. Can you imagine that magnetizing, though? I mean, it, of course, that's why it's sticking to that. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys. I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.